passionate. I work hard so when it pop, it ain't on accident. Yeah, I'm always on go, better watch your Hi loves, welcome back to the channel. So I am cranking out these hauls. I have about maybe three more left to do. So I'm doing really, really good, okay? Um, so um, I do have on white underwear. I wore white underwear all day for all these hauls. So you're gonna really know what material is quality and what, what material is not quality um, or high quality rather. So this is a lovely wholesale haul. You guys know I did try them out previously, maybe about a month or two ago. Um, and I liked a few things. It had to be more than two months ago because I wore something around Delory's birthday. So, um, anywho, so let's go ahead and get into the haul. I'll have everything linked down below. I have the sizes and prices on the screen. You guys know how it works over here. So this two piece set here, um, I actually have it in orange and I have it in pink. Sadly, it doesn't fit, um, how it's supposed to. If I turn around, you're going to see basically my white underwear. Um, this just, I don't know. The material is just not it. It is stretchy, but it is not, it's not staying. Okay. So, um, if you look at the back, definitely see my underwear, which are white granny panties because I love granny panties, <laughs> but no, seriously, um, that's just what I grabbed for. So, and it was a good decision because y'all know it was high quality now. Um, which was a good decision because it turns out a lot of this is see-through okay but as you can see the back of this definitely is not cute or flattering so i honestly don't even think i'm going to keep these around for myself i probably just let delery have them um, i just wanted these to work out and i'm tired about <laughs> i'm always picking out workout stuff and you know i just wear the same old sports bra and freaking shorts when i go down there so I gotta do better so let's go ahead and get into some more stuff from lovely wholesale i'm gonna bring everything to the front so you guys i guess can get a sneak peek so this set here was impossible to tie but i had it i did it i don't know how um so this is just a pink like snakeskin print i feel like yeah snakeskin print set um it's wide leg um, i don't purse i like the material actually i just don't personally like the fit i feel like it's really really um short in the butt area um but yeah it is see-through as you can see um it is a thin lightweight material it does have stretch to it but i just personally feel like i don't know how i like it on me so you can definitely untie it which um is better <laughs> because it was so impossible to tie it i don't know why or how but um, I feel like the model actually had it tied up. So if you want it, if they wanted it to, I guess, give you that option and that's how you're going to portray it, give it a little more room in here. So I have um, about four more two-piece sets. Then I have some like tops, dresses, and bottoms as well. I'm really excited about the dresses, but let's go ahead and get through the rest of these sets. So then we have this set here, which is eerily similar to two companies that i tried a tie-dye skirt set from absolutely the same concept with the tie you can tie it here um and you know just let it hang down or whatever and then you have the little you know tank top crop top tank crop top we'll call it that um really similar but however i like these colors the best out of all three companies that i did try i don't know i just really like this and i think it's a good transition piece and if you're gonna wear it probably um you know with these um, months here, it's like cool in the beginning like the of the day. You get hot in the middle and then it cools down again. So I think this could definitely rock with some sandals and a jean jacket. Um, just as a good transition set. Um, this other thing that I thought was a set is actually a dress. So we only have two more, I believe, to try on. This is the back. I do like the material of this one here may still be a little bit sheer but um this is one of the better materials haven't decided if i was going to keep this around yet but i do kind of like the way it looks i do like this one i'm not gonna lie about that so that's this set here and i do apologize <laughs> i know i'm looking up because of the freaking viewfinder i should bring it down some huh so let's go ahead and get into these other set this set is cute but not as advertised. I cannot stand when companies take images from, you know, smaller boutiques or just off of Google or something and run with it. Like this set looks 
nothing like what it's supposed to look like this skirt is supposed to actually be like a bodycon um you know midi skirt this is absolutely not that however um i i don't have a problem with it i just have a problem with it not being as advertised so this skirt set here i will link it down below so you guys can see it but this be wary be mindful of what you're ordering because this is not what it's pictured to be so this two-piece set here is just um the wrong material it's like a spandex and i'm over here just scratching my hair but no it's like a spandex material and it's supposed to be like a ribbed like fitted material but um hey look i don't know what to say i don't know what to tell you but this ain't how this skirt is supposed to fit and i already told you guys last time that i had an issue with lovely wholesales images and the fit of their items so that's this set here not the same thing that they advertised okay so this is just the same pink set that i did with the orange so this is the same um like a short kind of tank crop top set um as the orange one so the fit is absolutely the same um over here we have a little bit too much um like extra room up here and then in the shorts we don't have enough room in the butt area however i really do love this color i'm thinking about just kind of keeping this around for a picture but i just don't i'm tired of hoarding clothes i'm tired of it so again definitely too small back here you can see my underwear um yeah so this just ain't it okay and i don't need to um ramble anymore about it so here's something i'm really happy about so you guys know i actually tried these pants um in black from another company um but they were definitely not fitting in this area so um i did tell you guys that i will be trying it from somewhere else and this was the company so i will say they are a bit long they don't have as much drama um i feel like the material from the other company was definitely better but this material is just way stretchier and more comfortable i don't feel like my circulation is going to be cut off in the knees and i don't feel like my butt is going to be hanging out so i do like the way these fit and i will keep these around i also have them in blue so i'm going to try them on um the material is thin uh, maybe see through uh, and I feel like it's not enough structure in the leg area it does give you more movement I kind of like that and I'm definitely keeping these around okay um, I might actually hem them or just cut off some of the material at the foot area because it is too long but yeah this is the back of those pants here with this material it kind of gives me 80s and 90s like gym material i kind of just wish they would have chose the same material that the tie-dye skirt is made out of because this is just a little too shiny a little too out there but i think i can definitely make it look like something i'm just getting workout vibes you know they used to have like the sweatbands around their ankles or the sweat socks and stuff like that's what i'm getting however i do like this style i do like the fit of these pants these seem a little bit thinner and more see-through than the black ones i'm definitely keeping the black ones but these are up in the air i do love the way they fit though like they're super duper comfortable i like these i feel like a mermaid with the shininess so this is the back of those which just look like that so of course no i would not wear this together but this is just one of the tops from the website and i didn't have anything else to try it on with i almost feel like it was supposed to be a dress but they just was like let's just make it a top because if you sew this down here you have yourself a dress but it's supposed to be like one of those sexy tops where you have it like knotted here and then it's kind of like you know a bam pair of jeans i feel like this could have been cute with a pair of flare jeans or with a pair of straight leg jeans and some heels but i don't think it was like executed how i would like it so just a really long weird type of shirt to be honest but this is the back of it here so then we have this hair which i definitely have seen worn as just a dress but it's supposed to be a top um personally i feel like it's kind of cute as a dress not not with this underwear choice but um maybe a leotard or um i don't know uh, i guess you can wear a pair of jeans under it but it's just like this i like the way this is executed i actually like this more than i thought i would and then underneath is just 
um not underneath but at the bottom it's just like this tool material that has these pearls like sewn to it or glued to it i think it's really really nice and if you were to wear this you know as your birthday fit or whatever i would see i don't know how to feel about it <laughs> so i don't know how to feel about it but i think it's really really cute and don't mind my granny panties y'all but um yeah this is what the back is looking like let me go ahead and okay so this dress here i think is very cute and very effortless i don't mind the material i don't know i said i don't know i don't mind how it's made i love the pockets i love the belt this is something more appropriate more friendly more easy to dress rather than that last shirt dress thing so um yeah this is something real chill and simple where i can see you wearing it to a barbecue beach vacation whatever so i do like this dress here and i feel like it's a good transition in piece because of the colors in it so again it has pockets it has a belt and it's just a long you know kind of maxi dress it does fall like right before my ankles or right at the top of my feet so yeah that's this dress here and i'm getting a low battery sign so i'm definitely about to go ahead and change that battery before my camera just flat out dies now that we have a fresh battery so this one also has pockets basically the same style but this is definitely a different material that other one is more like a um i wouldn't say thicker but like a um softer feel it still has stretch but this one just seems like a complete stretch spandex material but it's the same concept with the pockets and you know just the belt so I do like this in orange. I already have it in yellow and I also tried it in mint, but those were from two, not two, but another company, those two dresses. So I'm just not sure if I want to keep it in orange, although I really do, like I said, I have come to love orange, um, thanks to you guys and Kirsten. So I just don't know. Same dress concept, same execution, just a different material. And I'm trying to get more into the fall, so I'm not really sure about keeping all of these summer pieces. So this is like my end of summer um, haul galore. Like I'm going to have about four or five hauls with some summer pieces. But um, we're getting into the fall season, so we're getting more and more fall things sent over. So I absolutely do not remember picking out this dress. So this is just like a tube dress with some type of prints going on and colors. Um, I, I just don't remember picking it out. It is thin. It's very stretchy. Um, I mentioned to you guys in the first Lovely Wholesale haul that I did that they, I, don't, I just don't really care for, you know, the dresses. Um, especially the ones they said were tube dresses. And I just need to see it on their own models because taking pictures and trying to replicate the items are not working. So this is the back of the garment here. Um, I'm not keeping it because I don't even remember, like I said, picking this out. And it probably was supposed to look totally different than what, it's, what it is on, so that's why I don't remember it. So I'm pretty sure I picked this out to be a cover-up. This um, is really just, you know, you can see everything. Um, I probably picked this out for a bathing suit cover-up. I have this white bandeau bathing suit that I would wear this with. Um, I really like this as a cover-up if you want to wear it as a birthday dress you do you honey but i just don't see myself wearing this as a dress because it is so exposed on the side over here so as you can see it's definitely super duper open um on the side comes up really high and then this is what the back is looking like i actually really do love the whole off shoulder thing and then the long sleeve thing over here i think this is a really nice cover up piece if that's what it's supposed to be so i have another similar one which i think is more birthday ish appropriate rather than wearing this one so i'm gonna try that one on and then after that we will only have two more dresses i absolutely love this and i do see this as a cover up piece too however i have this nude bodycon dress that i could wear under here where it would look like you're you know nude underneath but you're really covered. Um, I think this is really cute. I really like the way this is done. And I can also see this being like a beach cover up um, if you don't want to wear it as a dress, as you know, some people would wear it as a dress. So um, yeah, I just, I really dig this. I actually have a banjo and some biker shorts that are nude and I have the tube, 
um, tube top bodycon. So I, I'm really excited about this. I'm definitely keeping this one and the last one around. Again, the last one is more beach wear, pool wear. And this one I think is more sexy. You can definitely wear it also um, around your house to be sexy, around your partner to be sexy, something like a lingerie. I think this is definitely really, really cute. And I, I really do like this one. So this is just the back of this one, which again, these are both really see-through. So, um, you know, you better be going somewhere to slay or you better be going somewhere to swim. But I just think that this is so pretty. I went and looked in the mirror and I was like, yeah, I like that. <laughs> of course not with my granny panties, but um, yeah, I really do like this. Okay, so this one here is not what I thought it would be. I like the material. Um, it is showing up see-through. I definitely couldn't zip it by myself. I'm trying to move my hair to see if it'll even like start the zip. But yeah, I couldn't zip it um, by myself. And I feel like I don't want to um, pull it too much because I feel like the zipper isn't, um, it's going to break. So uh, yeah, I don't see myself wearing this because it is too snug here. And I think it just takes away from the actual dress. But I do like the poofy sleeve. I think it's really cute. But like I said, I couldn't zip it up. And it's definitely, not you sis, but it's definitely too short for me. I'm so excited about this yellow dress. I cannot wait to put it on. So let's go ahead and get out of this mauve one, which isn't quite the right fit. And get into this yellow one here, which is super duper cute. All right, so hopefully I'm kind of showing up. I feel like this color is kind of washing out, um, you know, my skin tone and stuff like that. So this dress here is like, it's showing up neon, but in person it's more, it's not really neon. It's like a yellow green, but not the bright in your face one. I really like this. I like the slip underneath, which kind of just gives you a little more security. Um, I do like that it's off the shoulder and that the sleeves have this nice little belt on them. I just think this is a really cute dress. I like the chiffon. Um, and even though it's kind of short, the slip underneath, I still think it looks really, really cute. Um, personally, I will wear a pair of black spandex shorts just in case the butt cheeks did want to pop out back here. But um, it does get a little bit short in the back area of this. But I just think that overall, this is a really cute. And you know, um, I feel like you still have a little bit of sexiness to it without being overtly sexy. So thank you guys so much for joining. I hope you enjoyed this lovely wholesale haul. I hope you like my take on um, some of these like newer companies that I've been trying out and experiencing. Um, I feel like some things are over sexified um, and that is the trend and the age that we're living in but there are still some people who want to be a little covered a little whatever you know not everything too skin tight so um, I just want companies to kind of cater to all types of personalities um, as far as you know how people want to express themselves um, as far as the materials can definitely be better 100% um, I only had about maybe three things where I actually enjoyed the material but there are a lot of things where I feel like it's just super duper cheap and like I said nobody wants to feel like they're you know just in a two dollar five dollar ten dollar outfit like you can make something inexpensive and still have some like class to it so again I hope you enjoyed it this is my second time trying lovely wholesale this time around I did enjoy it last time it wasn't so bad towards the end the two-piece sets were really great this time I think the dresses were nice um the pants are nice. Uh, Two-piece sets were okay. Not really. So, um, yeah. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I hope you enjoy my authentic take on Lovely Wholesale. 